Hey everybody, what's going on? It's Miss Tahino with Miss Hino's Lego Robotics. Man, it's really good to be back into my room again. Um, just being able to see all the robot things and get away from the house as far as, you know, just I wasn't able to do all the robotics things that I wanted to just because all of my gear is here. So today's video is going to be Tricky from the Inventor Kit. I was just curious to see how good would Tricky do on a first Lego League mission, actually multiple first Lego League missions. So what I did is I set up my city shaper table with all the mat and models. And what I'm gonna do in this video is put Tricky to the test and see if he is able to do all of the missions just like the EB3 robot. So today you get to find out, hey, how good is this inventor kit with first Lego League missions? He now Lego Robotics. So if you're wondering, I've left you a link to the inventor kit in the description. This is Tricky and you can find the instructions for Tricky. I'll leave that in the description for you also. So today it's all about putting Tricky on the city shaper table and seeing if Tricky can do all of the missions just like the EV3 robots. Because my big curiosity is how you know versatile, how accurate is Tricky to do all of these missions? So what I'm gonna do is take him to the table and it's been such a long time since I've seen the City Shaper table, but I'm gonna go ahead and put Tricky to the test. So let's go to the table. Wow, guys, it's just been so long since I've actually done any of the missions on of this mat before. In fact, if you guys watched previous videos, this mat was the mat we had out when our school shut down. So when I came back to kind of clean things up, this mat was still here. So. Today, what I'm gonna do is just go through those missions. I, I know I said all, but for the sake of getting this video out, you know, in a reasonable amount of time, I might have to bypass some of the tougher missions, but definitely a lot of the missions that you guys did with City Shaper, I'm gonna go ahead and put Tricky to the test. Now, Tricky is exactly the way Tricky was. I mean, I might modify the front part of here, you know, just so that um, he's able to do some of these missions um, like you guys did, but you know, other than that, Tricky is exactly the way um, the instructions had him built. There wasn't really any modifications I made, like I said, just to the front end attachment here. So just to get certain things done here, like the traffic jam and the swing like that. So let's, you know, without further ado, let's go ahead and get started on these missions. Are you ready, Tricky? You got it, Mr. Hino, let's do this.
was amazing about Tricky going up that ramp for elevated places, a lot of the robots that I have tried out for EV3 cannot go up that ramp because they're so low to the ground or they have a color sensor. So that was pretty amazing by Tricky. Okay guys, so there you have it. Tricky, I'm, I'm just gonna say, is a really good first LEGO League robot. Um, no, I'm not trying to steer any of you guys away from EV3 to the inventor. No, I'm not getting paid for this as a sponsorship. Um, but that was my curiosity. How would Tricky do uh, with first LEGO League type missions? I'm gonna look you guys right in the eye here. Um, I, doing these missions, spent less time having to adjust things and have it veer off to the left or right. The only thing that I saw it veered off to the left or right was when Tricky was pushing that big old stack of tan blocks. But that happened with all robots. Just because the weight um, is different, it's not gonna perfectly go straight. But for all those other missions, like the ones you saw for the elevated places, this thing was going pretty straight. And so I'll just be honest, when I would run the same missions with the EV3, I would have you know different variations of going left or right. I would have to redo those missions. But with Tricky, I spent less time adjusting and I spent less time just redoing those missions. Just gonna be you know super honest here. So Tricky, in my book, gets an A plus for just those standard first LEGO League missions. Um, I'm not doing any combinations. I don't have any huge attachments to take on or off. But if you're just trying to do simple first LEGO League missions, Tricky is a champ. So for those of you that are thinking about giving the Inventor Kit a shot for first LEGO League type missions, you definitely get a thumbs up for me as far as just, you know, it being able to do everything that the EV3 robots have done in the past. So if you're just wondering, you get my thumbs up on this one, okay guys? All right, hopefully you guys are still staying safe, having fun. I am Mr. Hino from Mission Zego Robotics. I'm out. He's out. He's out. We got this. We got this. We got this, guys. Hey guys, Mr. Hino here. Thank you so much for watching. And if you love robotics, don't forget to check out these videos also because they're cool. Okay, guys, take care.